Hi, I'm here to pick up the pair of earrings which I brought in last week to have fixed. Oh yes, I remember those. Look I'm really sorry, but they are not ready yet. Why not? Well, to be honest, we can't find the left earring. What on earth do you mean, you can't find it? And they are drop earrings, how do you even know which is right and which is left? Well, we can't find it. We don't know where it is. When we look in the place that it's meant to be, it's not there. Its whereabouts are unknown. It is lost. Its location is a mystery. I'm not sure how else to say it. Shut up will you? I know what the word lost means. What I don't understand is how my earrings can be lost. I brought them here in a little plastic bag, gave them to you, and you put them in the safe. How can they be lost? Well, the thing is, they are very pretty earrings, with all the diamonds and rubies and stuff. I know. That's why I want them back. Yes, well, the thing is, the boss's daughter had her year 12 formal a couple of weekends ago, oh those stupid formals. Paying a thousand dollars for a dress, and for what? Just because they finished school. It's ridiculous. Anyway, the earrings were perfect for the daughter's dress. So the boss let her borrow them. He let his 17-year-old daughter borrow my earrings. Without even asking? Well, you did give them to him. To be repaired. Anyway it wasn't really Candy's fault. She was dancing with one of the guys and jiggling up and down like the kids do because they have no idea how to dance, and the earring must have jiggled loose. Well, now you have a problem. Get the earring back, or replace it. Um, no, actually it's not our problem at all. The repair contract which you signed said that you accepted that we would have no responsibility for any loss or damage to the earrings, no matter how the loss or damage was caused. So you're really just going to throw me under the bus here? Don't blame me. You should read stuff before you sign it.